Hey, hey, beautiful babes, your girl, sweet angel. Today is a day that we're going to do some self-care stuff. Yeah, it's today, tomorrow, the rest of the week. Right now, I'm getting ready to color my hair. Um, I'm, I've been thinking about doing something different with my hair. I don't know what yet. Don't, don't know, but... <laughs> maybe a possibility. Listen, if this is the first time that you're coming behind the scenes with your girl, Sweet Angel, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Make sure you tap the post notification bell cause it's about to get lit right here on the channel. So please do that for me. And today is all about the hair color. I've gotten lots of questions about uh, what do I put in my hair, the hair coloring, yada, yada, yada. So right now, I'm just gonna show you all the products that I'm using or that I use to color my hair with and uh, bleach it basically is what it is right now. Uh, I did rinse it out last night. I use my um, Jamaican black castor oil. Actually, I just have some in this little bottle here. I have the coconut scented IQ Naturals Jamaican Black Castor Oil. I always put a drop of that in my hair when I wash it or maybe a teaspoon and just let it drench, drench my scalp. That is what's creating this heck of a thickness in my hair, along with some other things that I'll be sharing in a future video. But right now, I'm using IQ Naturals just to moisturize my scalp and my hair. When I rinsed it last night, I didn't put any other products on it. I just went to bed, okay? And might I say that was not last night. It may have been like 4 a.m. this morning. So, now in preparation of getting my hair, um, bleach together. I'll show you the products that I use and the steps as I go through it. So the first thing that I'm going to use, I actually use this to protect my uh, hair from over bleaching, my scalp, my edges. I put this all around my hair. This is Vaseline, of course. Yes, Vaseline has so many wonderful purposes when it comes to beauty that it's amazing. So I'll be looking over here uh, because that is where my mirror is. So I have a nice glob of Vaseline. I just roll it around in my hands and I take it around my edges, my ears, back of my neck, and then I take the rest and I just go through into my scalp with it. And this will help prevent any burns, etc. Okay, so, and yes, my hair is actually gotten so thick. I have definitely not lit up off of the Jamaican Black Castor Oil like I told y'all in some previous videos that I was going to use it faithfully and I know what my hair needs and it always needs that. Okay, now when it comes to bleaching my hair, uh, the product that I've used forever, like for years, a decade, has been Clairol Professional BW2. This is the powder lightener that I use. Now, in order to mix mine, uh, a lot of people have mixing bowls and all of that stuff. I keep it simple. This I keep in the bathroom. This is just a old container of the BW2. I simply pop the top. This is where I mix mine it, right in here. Now the BW2 does come with a scooper and That scooper looks like that. I take me a nice scoop of it. Take a look in here. Dump it in. That's not enough. Two cups. Mm, that's not enough. And three cups. All right. I do have an extra little cup here for my Superstar number 30 volume developer this is a cream peroxide developer that i've been using forever clairol also has one and then superstar makes one i'll have my links below for you to purchase these if you like and i just pour in until i get it to a consistency that i like it's one two three, 
we'll try four right now and let's mix it up and see all I do to mix mine is I use my rat tail comb and I mix it up here so this is the consistency I have after three scoops of the powder the lightning powder and four cups of the developer the cream peroxide developer okay that's what you're looking at right there all right which is perfect and I just rinse this little cup out and I put it back under my sink now if you have sensitive skin or you're just not used to working with the um, developer and the peroxide and, and the lightener make sure you wear gloves I don't wear gloves I've never worn gloves except for probably when I first started then I realized hey I'm putting it on my scalp it's not doing anything I'm putting it on my hands it's not doing anything so I'm good so that's me but you don't have to do like I do because you know that might not be right so I'm not telling you to do that so basically I just take my comb and I go around the edges first and just try to lighten those because for whatever reason they are the hardest to lighten up and the rest of it I just put on with my hands now that I got that all out of the comb and I will be using the comb later and then I take a wad of it in my hand and I just work it back because the back is so dark back here I'm working in really good and I can actually feel where I'm, I should be going that was perfect just a perfect amount of the mixture Now in order to relax those curls or locks in your hair, this will definitely help to do that by combing through the product, okay? Some people say don't, it could damage your hair. Again, you don't have to do like I do, but just if you're asking how do I do my hair, here we go. Yes, it can get messy for sure. All right, now that this is on, I leave it on for about 15 minutes. Now, my camera did cut off. I'm not sure where it cut off at. Basically, again, um, I just take my rat tail comb here and I combed it through, slicked it back. This is just to kind of help give my hair a little looser curls than it had previously because my hair did the tighten up. So now I leave this on for about 10, 15 minutes, no more than 20, okay? I'm usually, you know, pretty cautious about that. Um, a lot of people have left this stuff on, you know, trying to lighten their hair. Of course, mine is already lightened on the ends. It's just the roots mainly, but I do bleach it over and over again because I do like mine to be as platinum as possible. So now that I did all that, it's just the waiting game. Once I finish the um, time that I wanted to have it left on, I go ahead and wash my hair. No particular shampoo. Right now, I'm just using this shampoo just to rinse it clean. This is just VO5 two in one this is with soy milk protein it's a shampoo and conditioner together but after i finish uh washing my hair which i'm going to just, just jump into the shower for that 
I will be doing a mask on my hair today. I will video that, but it'll be in a separate video. So you'll see me actually doing a mask for my hair just to deep condition it, to soften it, to, um, you know, help strengthen my hair and my hair follicles. I will be doing that on camera for you. So that is it for this moment. Now I'm just going to wait it out, hit the shower, and I'll be back after then and let you see my hair at that point. Then I'll move on from there to a mask, which I'll have again in a separate video for you. Anything that I'm using today will be listed in the description box. Remember the description box is underneath the video. So if you're in your cell phone, just turn it a long ways and you'll see uh, the actual description there. Just click the little drop down right by the title and you'll see all the information you're able to click on my affiliate links there or you can just type in and search for those items yourself or find them at your local stores uh, but I will have everything that I'm using today listed for you so you'll know exactly what that is and that's pretty much it for this moment but I will pipe back in once I have taken my shower and washed my hair out I'll see you then all right, beautiful babes, I'm back. It's been, again, about 10 minutes or so, and I'm getting ready to rinse this out of my hair. Again, the shampoo that I'm using is the VO5 2-in-1 Shampoo and Conditioner. No particular shampoo that you have to use. I am going to be switching over because I've been eyeballing a couple of shampoos that I may convert to, but, you know, I haven't really put my eye on one <laughs> at this moment, but I think I will. Uh, I just get these at the Dollar Tree, so which is cheap, okay? So let me go ahead and wash my hair out and I'll let you see it after then, okay? All right, beautiful babes, out of the shower. This is the hair right now. Just getting ready to go ahead and get my little mask done on it. It is ready to be moisturized, so that's what that mask is going to help. Now, you should be able to click on a link above in maybe the next day or so to check out that mask because it's going to be on Beauty by Sweet Angel. My battery is getting ready to die. I'll see y'all on the next video. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and have yourself a wonderful day. And please share me with your world. Bye.